I, to me, it's like, I feel like that's almost like my calling as a Christian. You know, like, the term Christian literally means to be like Christ, you know? And breaking it all the way down for me is when, when Christ lived here, and he walked around and did everything that we do. He, he became flesh, the Bible said, so he was literal human, you know? And he hung out with everybody. That's what he did, you know? And a lot of times, like, take the story of the tax collector, the short guy, Zacchaeus. He's in this tree, right? And he's trying to see Jesus speak to all these people. And Jesus says, Zacchaeus, why don't you come out of the tree and, and I'm going to have dinner with you. He didn't say, Zacchaeus, get out of the tree. I'm God. I'm going to help you. Did not say that. First, he said, Zacchaeus, let's go have dinner. And I assumed he walked in the house and maybe had an olive or two or whatever they ate. And he did the festivities, and then he said, hey, salvation has come to your whole home today. And the Bible says that he said, to your whole home. And why do I think that he said whole home? Because that's where Zacchaeus related. Zacchaeus had a big family. Like, you know what I mean? Jesus found people where they were. The Samaritan woman, which was totally illegal and jacked up. And I could go on all day with examples. But before he said, I'm God, and I can help you, and you shouldn't be a prostitute anymore, he said, can I have a drink? Why did he do that stuff? Why? Why was he personable? Because no one is going to trust in something they don't see to be kind and personable and real. No one. You know what I mean? And if we really are being Christians, the real term Christians, why don't we do that? No one is interested in coming to a country club. No one. I think I would walk into a golf place and go, can I have a membership please? Absolutely not. The same way a lot of non-Christians look at our big, huge buildings with our flat screen TVs and our millions of dollars worth of carpet and garbage and go, I want to go there. That's so awesome. They're going to go, I'm not allowed there. I'm not wanted there. So my, I think our and my goal as a Christian is to, is to open my arms up as big as I can and say, look, I got faults. I got issues, but Jesus loves you and your life matters. And if I can be of any help to you, if we can pray together, great. If you need an, an ear, if you need an, uh, a shoulder, whatever you need. 